a community that refuses to give up. I'm Aya Sargent in Perry. Neighbours tell me it's that resilience that has allowed Taylor County to rebuild as much as it has since Hurricane Adalia. Do you need help? Do you need help? A phrase echoing around town even six months later as neighbours continue recovery and rebuilding efforts. Scarring from Hurricane Adalia still exists in Taylor County. You'll see some of the trees that still are leaning. Along with blue tarp on roofs. Pastor Willie Anderson of Victory International Prothetic Ministries shows me the reminders of the impact of Adalia. So of the side of the church was torn off. But despite this damage, some of which you can still see driving around, recovery efforts have never faltered in Taylor County. Boots on the ground. It just, it, you know, that, that, that phrase really exemplify the city of Perry, Florida. He's one of the many organizations who have been working to make sure needs are met. And dry their clothes. Along with churches, the city, the county, law enforcement, first responders, and many more agencies, even outside of Taylor County lines. It's neighbors helping neighbors. We've got siding all down. A lot of people didn't look for us to bounce back as fast as we did. Tina Allswain stayed with her daughter during the storm. You could feel it pick up off of the brick. Once it was over, her focus immediately turned to helping the community. You're in my community. We're going to get this out of your yard. A neighborly love that has resonated for and around this town since it was hit. That's the type of county you want to raise your children in. It's made full recovery feel attainable. Dan Anderson runs the food ministry at First United Methodist Church in Perry. He agrees. You know, where money's having to go from, from food into repairs. Although he says lines at their food distribution in collaboration with Second Harvest have gotten longer since the storm by about 25%. He thinks that's because impacts of the hurricane were aggravated by the closure of the Georgia Pacific Foley Cellulose Mill. He says in the next six months, he'd like to see more jobs brought into the community. Danny Collins, chairman at the Perry Taylor County Chamber of Commerce, says that's a big focus in this recovery effort. We need to ensure that, that we're attracting new employers to the community. That's going to be a, a big part of this, working with the Taylor County Development Authority, uh, County Commission and City Council. And he tells me they're working to retain the strong force that already resides in Taylor County. Pastor Willie is more than hopeful for the future. We are always are going to bounce back. We're always going to come from the ashes. And that those scars around Taylor County will eventually fade. Danny tells me area leaders are speaking with figureheads in other communities who have been through similar situations to learn and adjust. He tells me they're optimistic about the future of Taylor County. In Perry, Mayor Sargent, ABC 27.